Where's the stage? I, I um, uh, is this is that Game of Thrones? I guess it's Game of Thrones. Fire emblem. Three houses. Chelsea fan, you brought your best to the table. I think I think that I is Game of that. Thrones, though. I think you're right. That's the only thing that. I think it's a line. Weird, yeah, weird Wait. looking chair. Let, let me let me turn volume. Is this? Is this? This is Fire Emblem, but it's not Three Houses music. So, and it could just be Fire Emblem music then. It, it could have been. I, I think that gives it more of a reason to be Game yeah. of Thrones, honestly. I mean, it also could have been like a Three Houses stage made before Byleth music was in Smash. Yeah. Dude, I, I think it's Game of Thrones, though. But it I just, do, it's up for discussion. I would like to think that Chelsea fan just really likes Game of Thrones and is holding out for them to get the correct season finale. Or do you think finale. he's a petitioner? He, he's absolutely a petitioner. Like, I, I got mad respect for petitions because, like, I, it, you know, be the change you want to see in the world and all that. Yeah. And, and I get that. But some people petition the dumbest shit. Dude, do you remember Kevin Durant left Oklahoma City Thunder? Yep. Changed Durant, Oklahoma to Westbrook. And which is crazy. Because it's not like that city was named after Kevin Durant. Yeah, uh, more of a coincidence, some might say. Yeah. Also, who gives a shit about basketball? And also, it, just imagine, they're like, okay, we're going to change our name from this player to another player who will inevitably leave us. Yeah. Which, it kind of, like, baffles me to, like, that's one thing, like, the sports world, people act like they, everyone, like, has, like, these beefs and stuff, like, with Kevin Durant specifically, like, yeah. like, I was like, oh, Westbrook and Durant hate each other, it's like, no, dude, like, they were friends for years, and they, I'm pretty sure they're still friends, like, they hang out. Bro, he got cursed, though. He, he did get cursed. No, Little Beaver removed the curse. He did, but yeah. he was, that does not mean he was yeah. never cursed. He, he was cursed, mm -hmm. but now, now he's cursed no more. If you didn't know, uh, Little B, the base god, released... I don't even think calling it like a diss track is the right word. Yeah, it was just kind of a beat. He released anything? a musical hex. Yeah. On, yeah. on Kevin Durant. In a song I was just like, fuck Kevin Durant. Fuck Kevin Durant. And then All of Oklahoma got pissed about that song too. Yeah. Because they're like, we, we love Kevin Durant. But then Kevin Durant oh, like, so I love cute. Beat. Oh. I love Beat Kirby. But yeah, then never Durant left Oklahoma at Lil B. Removed the curse yeah. via Twitter. Or thank you, Lil B. Yeah, thank you, Lil B. Does Kirby or does Kirby like charge it up over time? Yeah. Um, okay. This is true for Kirby and Rob, but you see the little dot on their head, how it's glowing red. Yeah. That means full charge. Oh. Yeah. I never noticed that dot in the first place. Uh, Smash has a ton of little visual indicators. You see yeah. Rob's spine, how it has that little blue light going up it. No. Like, look at his spine very closely. You yeah. see under his arms, he has that little blue line going up and down? Yeah, kind of. That's how much gas he has in the tank of his uppie. Wait, what? Yeah. His uppie is gas-based? Yeah. Is it not just... So wait, how does he get uppie back? Is it just over time? Time, passively. Oh. Okay, that's a little bit less busted. Yeah, so like, Rob can't stay off stage forever. And it's not like he only has X amount in one upbeat. Like, if you f max it out and then try and upbeat again, you just won't be able to do it. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Yeah. But it's still, like, such a large amount. Oh, my... Wait, the Ditto? Yeah, the Dittos. Dude, the Ditto closed that game out. That That's a victory lap right there. Yeah, not being able to do an inhale for, like, a stock trade is actually so bad. Five, four, three, was that BM? I think I was BM. Five, <laughs> oh, my God. Did you see that mash with that upbeat? That was... Wow, King J. He is, he has nothing better to do. He already ate dinner. He, Mom didn't make dinner or anything. He's just content with running the Alpharetta Plus Custom Coliseum lobby. Yeah, I'm, I'm about it. I, I don't know how many matches in a row he's won now, though. It has to be like. I mean, if we want to say four stocks and he has 27, I mean that would be five, and that's two. That's like seven matches. Yeah, that's a run. Yeah. Um, let me let me go on YouTube. This is how you really find out if if a player is good. You type in King J Smash Rob, because then you can find tournament vods. Oh, smart, smart. Monkey time's back. Damn, dude, I, I don't see any any King J. Yeah, this is a this is a hidden boss in the making. He's just a grinder. I think this is an actual Wi-Fi warrior. 
I forget that they do exist. Yeah, like, there are hidden bosses in Ultimate. Like, I'm not saying the next best player is already fiending Elite Smash. Because who knows if anyone's in Ultimate's lifetime will, like, dethrone Leo or something like that. Yeah. But there is definitely, like, a top 10, top 20 caliber player. Not, like, now, but, like, potentially. That could uh, just, just be lurking online. Yeah, no, like... The... The next best, like, basketball players or, like, the next best football players started, like, you know... Yeah. They, they started this last year, like... Like, eventually somebody is going to take it over, yeah. Yeah, I'm sorry, it's laggy, and we've seen this stage already. All right. So... Monkey time is back, though. Yeah, welcome back, monkey time. Um, I, I just... I'm curious, like, I would kick King J, see how... Just for it to go faster, but I'm really curious to see how far he can go. I don't think he's going to lose... Yeah. I'll be very real. Because, like, we've watched Amiibos just run lobbies yeah. for, like, two hours. plus hours. I, and now we have a raw player, which is even more terrifying. I'm just kind of, like, impressed. Yeah. It's just the legacy of that is King J. Yeah. And welcome, Hannah the Little Mac. Um, I've not seen Little Mac. Dude, that's what we picture. should do. We just, we just fiend. Like throughout Smash Ultimate, Custom Coliseum. Yeah. And then we're like, all right, in two years, COVID will be lifted. And then we can go to events. We'll see how far you can go, King J. We're cheering you on. You, you'll be the Evo 2025 winner. Dude, I would absolutely like... If somebody told me after they won Evo Grand Finals yeah. that they were a plussy, I'd be like, oh, fuck yeah, dude. Just no, imagine, I'd be hyped about it. imagine if like they were part of Custom Coliseum. They're like, oh, that's really what got my start in c competitive Smash. <laughs> yeah, this, this is King J's origin story. <laughs> this is an essential part of the King J documentary that Cloud9 is going to release I one day. I assume he's like a LeBron fan, right? Yeah, he is. Yeah, that, that's what it is. Yeah. Right? That's the name King J. Yeah, King J. Yeah. Like, King J the Bowser. Alright. King, King J the Bowser the Rob main. Okay. What? What? This, this is abstract. Like, this is definitely Picasso. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, um, um. Wait, King J won? How does he always turn out <laughs> to get these situations? <laughs> how does he always come out on top? I, I don't know. Wait, okay, now he's out. Oh, he's out. He's trying to get back in, though. I think he has a better chance than K. Rule does. Yeah. Whoa, whoa. Okay. All right, good job, King J. Oh, wait, wait. No, now I see how he got in there. There's just a platform. Yeah. Just go in there. I'm willing to, like, finish this game out because I am very curious. I don't think it's going to go to time. I think that... Because I think yeah, King J is well. feeding for the Switch. Yeah, I, I think King J realizes that there's no reason for him to not. Yeah. Like, I, I really feel like, no offense to Corey, yeah. but I feel like the Switch definitely benefits the better Rob player than the K rule. Because here's the thing, Rob can upbeat and is still not in special fall. Yeah, meanwhile, K rule, he's, oh, he's oh, a heavy boy. Oh. Wow, he, he recovered. I'm surprised he didn't die by going up there. This is a, a this, tough spot for King J to be in. Dude, this stage oh, is shit. so trippy. What is it? What? He, he lives. He li is the stage moving or is the camera moving? Why? <laughs> Why? I, I like it though. Like I'm on the edge of my seat because I really don't know what's about to happen. All right. I, I like how they still find time to throw in a combo. Yeah, like he's gonna his nares in there. Okay. Uh, All right. I, I I have never been this tense for a match. That's really good neutral King J to teleport behind the wall to get out of that hit. Yeah. Because normally I would get like motion sickness from something like this, but I think it's just slow enough. Like any faster, and I'd be nauseous. It's giving me minor, but like I'm cool with it because yeah. I'm interested. Like, like like my face feels a little tingly right now. Yeah, I can feel it on my neck a little bit. Yeah, I feel it on my cheeks. Yeah. Oh, the cheeks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the cheeks are kind of there. But like for me, I'm just kind of like it, it's worth it. It's like being on a roller coaster, you know? Like I'm like I might feel bad after it, but goddamn it, it's gonna be fun. Yeah, like I didn't get to go to Six Flags this summer because of COVID, so this is yeah. a good second. This is like the pirate ship ride. You know what was the lamest invention in the whole world? The teacup ride? No. What? The roller coasters, quote unquote, <laughs> at Chuck E. Cheese, where they just slightly move up and down as you go up and up and down. Dude, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, like the it's a rocket ship or like yeah. a school bus, and there's like the the intense like da, 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 and it just moves music. up and down. Yeah. 
but dude, those have made so much money. Mm -hmm. They definitely like, have. Like, I I took my uh, nephew to Chuck E. Cheese for his birthday, or my family took him to his birthday, mm -hmm. and he did one of those rides. He, motherfucker did that ride like five times, and then his little sister did it too. That's Kids crazy. love those things. <gasps> Did you see him get outplayed right there? Yeah, that was so smart of King. Yeah, how, how do you know to teleport behind him so he couldn't use his final smash? Oh, you know, King, he might little be a four stock we're seeing here. I think I'm gonna like put a motion sickness warning on this part of the video. <laughs> just, yeah. Just so people know where to skip to, right? Oh, did you see that? <laughs> yeah. <He> just. <laughs> <laughs> that. That was that was destruction. He out schmooed him for three minutes straight. I can't believe Carol took Rob to one of the biggest gimmick stages I've ever seen, and he still got four stocked. Do people keep making these gimmick stages, and it's like it doesn't look like they're practiced on their own gimmick stages? Ten consecutive wins. Jesus Christ! You're doing great, King. Yeah. Wow. I'm gonna just, just wow. Like people, Ollie. Hashtag 5066 does not know what he's getting himself into. Yeah. Okay, Meta Knight. He's in the game, apparently. Yeah, I was about to say that. It's so crazy to me that there are, like, Meta Knight mains out there. There's Belmont players, dude. There's Belmonts. There's Ryu mains. Like, I get, like, carry mains and I get pin mains. I don't get Ryu mains. I get Ryu mains. But just... I think, I think uh, Tatsu's funny for Ryu. Tatsu? Yeah, it's really yeah. strong for no reason. It's just funny. That's fair. I don't, I, I just Gen's don't get funnier. those characters. Or do you, just, you don't mean like, I, why would someone play them? You're just saying you don't get yeah, them. Yeah, no, like, I just don't oh. understand them. Like, yeah. I kind of get the appeal of Terry and Ken, because they're like, okay, you know. They're mashers. They're, yeah, like, you can just mash the button. I don't really feel like you can do that with Ryu now. I can play Terry. I can play Ryu. Ken's definitely the hardest for me. Because, like... Uh, I guess like with Ryu, Ryu came out of Smash 4 DLC, so I got like isolated time to focus on him. Uh, Terry came out as Ultimate DLC, so I got isolated time to focus on him. Kenny just kind of snuck in the base game of Ultimate alongside like multiple other characters. Yeah. And he definitely wasn't like my first pick, so I never really got to spend that one-on-one -on -one time with Ken. So he's... Um, I still would not call Ken my worst character in Ultimate. I'd, I'd probably say Mega Man's my worst character in Ultimate. Yeah, I, I have no clue. You, you probably have Little Mac. I, yeah. I feel like if you didn't play Smash 4, Little Mac and Bayonetta probably are just my worst too, because that's so I, understandable. Yeah, like, I didn't play those games. I don't know how you're supposed to do their gimmicks. And yeah. Honestly, I'm not going to invest the time to learn how to of do course. their gimmicks. Like, I, I think I could teach you how to play Smash 4 Bayonetta, and you would, like, shit stomp all your friends. But, like, it's just not the same. Either. Yeah, like, if I'm playing Smash 4, I'm going to be playing it with, like, well, Smash Ultimate players, so I'm going to probably lose anyways. Yeah. I'm cool with that. Like, that's the thing. Like, all Melee players in Smash 4 liked Cloud, but at the same time, Cloud was the most gimpable character in the game, so Melee players would pick up Cloud and then just die at 20. See, I didn't like Cloud either, honestly. Yeah. I liked Mario, because I'm yeah. like, oh, he's still... I think easy the melee players they love they like Mario a lot. I saw that one. Yeah, I like Fox because I'm like oh, I still just nair and grab. That's yeah, that's easy enough. Instead of shine, you now use down air. Yeah, like it, it wasn't that bad. I think in ultimate, the characters I see the most is like all Fox players love Inkling. Yeah, which is so like I don't understand that. But I, as a melee player, I'm like no, I get it. Yeah, like, yeah. Uh, I'm just mashing left and right. Oh wait. Oh. He's safe because he just gets yeah, to like land in the things, the cannons. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> nice. he could have. Oh. oh. That's a win. That's yeah, a dub. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not it's good for Ollie. Yeah, not what he expected. Yeah. But King could have just mashed B or just buffered the B button. Yeah. I think. I would just let it rip, because why not? Yeah. It's like a 50-50, but you know that's yeah. good enough. Uh, this not doesn't good on do the anything stage, yeah. if he goes right there. Like, like he's playing this right. Yeah. He's gonna get a couple of balls, and that's it. Yeah, that could have been really good. This also does nothing. Yeah, I don't think I would do it. Oh, here. that might do something now. Oh yeah, because those little red lasers bring you in. I thought that was gonna do more. I, like it did damage, I guess. All right. Oh, this. Oh, is... uh, okay. Ditto, dude. Ditto's so good. Ditto's definitely an S tier Pokemon. Like the fact that Ditto will 
usually just hold forward. Okay, this one's not. This one's just actually playing. It raw. is Rob Ditto. Yeah. Dude, he is chilling up there. I think Dark Ride might secure a win. Good. Oh. Good move. Good move. Nice. This kills. This for sure kills. That this might be the king of the end of King J. Could be. Yeah. He, he's got to make something happen real quick. Yeah, he's, he's got, got 30 th seconds. I think if it goes to time though. I I'm gonna give it to King J. I, I I don't know. He's really camped behind the Volpix, which is definitely the play. Yeah. Oh, what's he got? Gardevoir. Not gonna help here. Oh, he can't even get over. Uh, all he knows, all he has to do is not die. Yeah. He. Every he's, Man Night player knows when it's time to camp. Yeah. He knows. Oh. Yeah. I thought he was gonna Go. fall into it. Ooh, that side view is not good. Oh. Oh, he did it. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. He lived. He won. Good invincibility on the... Oh. oh, I hate to see King J go down like that, but a win is a win. Yeah, I've... It's never been sad to see a Raw player lose before. Yeah.